Hey guys, I got another really cool boat for you to check out with me today. This is an 1862 Hunt Deck with twin Mud Buddy HD 5000 Anniversary Editions on the back. This boat is actually designed to do a lot of fishing in the Florida marshes and uh, way up some of the inlets and rivers that they have on the far Florida coastline that you just can't access with anything else except this or an airboat. You just have to have something like this. So they had long runs they had to make carrying big loads. They wanted power. That's how you get power, two mud motors in the back of something like this. So it's a nice big size boat. You can carry a big load in it, but it's got the power in the back to push it. And that's key when you're talking about moving a big boat with a mud motor, have enough power. Um, a lot of the features that you see are what you see a lot on our boats, but quite a few of them, they changed up a little bit. They have the back deck, they elongated the back deck and made it a little bit longer. One of the persons is going to be fishing a lot on the back deck and they wanted room back here. They, they did that by one thing, by adding about a foot to the back deck, but they also kept their rear storage bench flush with the same level as the back deck, adding 16 more inches to it. This side here has got a nice storage box and the one on the other side of the over here is a live well so that the person on the back deck doesn't have to leave the back deck to put fish in the live well couple of in-sunk uh, sunk in rod holders back here as well so they can sit in that chair and never leave and, and reach their rod holders. Um, in the front you have catwalks that run down both sides that are they serve as eight foot rod lockers on each side all lined with hydro turf. All of the applicable boxes that you can put turf in in here is all lined with the turf. This is a jump seat live well so this, this, this box here is also a second live well for the person that's in the front but it works as a jump seat, got the thick pad here and the thick pad there. Makes a nice comfortable seat to ride in in the boat. Very comfortable place to sit and ride. And then on the front deck up here, they've got the big storage boxes up here. And they use the friction hinges. So the friction hinges will hold the lid wherever you want it to go. And it also gives you the ability to fold it all the way back if you want to. All lined with turf, storage for tackle, whatever they need up there. Inside here, they've got the front deck hatch, which has trolling motor batteries, battery charger, all the stuff that you need inside there, throw cushions, life jackets. They have another uh, Helix Humminbird 8 up on the front that will uh, that is Etherneted to the one on the dashboard and works off of the US2 sonar and the Minn Kota trolling motor. Nice removable sight casting deck up here for when they want to sight cast. Couple more rod holders in the front, spotlight kit. All turfed out. They got they got some custom colored turf. They they changed up the colors of their paint job a little bit from what we normally do. This boat has got a, had a lot of thought went into it from this customer. A whole lot of thought, and and that's what we are able to offer you here. The ability to get it the way that you want it. They got stainless steel pop up cleats, and they got dimmer lights all the way around their deck, light up in green on a dimmer switch. Ride holders where they need to be, cup holders where they need to be, bimini top for when it gets hot and hard in the summertime. Really a super nice rig, and I just wanted to share it with you guys before it left. Thanks for checking it out.